So have you ever wondered how to add links to other videos in your own YouTube videos? In this three minute problem solver, I'm going to show you how to do just that. My name is Jerry Switek and I'm a district technology specialist for the Citrus County Schools down here in beautiful, sunny Florida. So I'm already signed into my YouTube account. I'm just going to go ahead and click on my channel over on the left hand side. And then I'm going to go into my video manager. And this is what's going to show me a list of all of my videos that I've uploaded to YouTube. Now, in this particular account, I only have one. So I'm going to click on this drop down here next to the edit button. And I'm going to choose annotations. Now, once on the annotation screen, my video will play. And I also have this slider down here that I can slide back and forth to choose a particular point in the video to add my annotation. I'm just going to go ahead and add the annotation to the very beginning. So you can see I already added one here. I'm going to go ahead and add another one. Actually, let's go ahead and trash this one so I can start over from scratch. So I'm at the very beginning of my video. I'm just going to choose add annotation and I'm going to go ahead and add, uh, let's add a speech bubble. There you can see my speech bubble appears. I'm going to make it a little bit larger and I'm just going to put in here, click here for additional information. You might be more uh, exact in what you put in there, but I'm just putting something really general in there. So I'm just going to drag this over here to the right hand side. Now I can change my font down here at the very bottom if I choose to make my font a little bit larger. I can also change my font color from black or white. And I can also change the fill color of this annotation box to some other color. I can also here using these numbers, the start and end fields, I can choose when the annotation will appear in my video and when it'll go away. Or I can drag this annotation to a particular point in my video. So let's go to about the 15 second mark and I want this video to appear for 15 seconds. So I drag the end of that to the 30 second mark. Now, what I need to do is go ahead and add a link so I can link to additional video content. Now I can link to either a single video, to a playlist, to a YouTube channel. I can also link to a Google Plus profile or I can link to my subscription page or even a crowdfunding project. So I happen to have a YouTube video on my clipboard. I'm just gonna paste that in there. And then I can also choose at what time I want that other video to begin. So if I want that other video to start at the one minute mark, I would set this uh, box here to one minute. And then I can also choose to open that link in a new window. So after I've added my annotation, I'm gonna click on save and I'm gonna apply those changes. And now when I watch that video, we will see that over here, if I scroll across here to about the 15 second mark, there we can see my, my annotation appears. And if I hover over that, you'll notice that it becomes a hyperlink. Now, when I click on that hyperlink, it brings me out to this TED Talk that I linked it to. So that is how you add an annotation to a YouTube video that you've created and uploaded and link it to additional content. My name is Jerry Switek, and that was your three-minute problem.